helping me. Oh, daar is het weer, hier. Pa, ja, alsjeblieft. Vandaag gaan onze Engelse story lees. Zijn naam is Ba, Moe, What Will We Do? Yay! Lekker story kijk, Lady. Hier die boek is zo so mooi voor mij. Kijk met al die prachtige prinkjes. Wow. Something special was happening on Buttercup Farm. The farmer had bought a kangaroo and it was arriving that very day. The farm animals had never seen a kangaroo before. Hmm. What can a kangaroo do anyway? They wondered. But nobody knew. Do you know what a kangaroo does? I'm sure you do. the rooster. What if she can crow? What if she gets up very early every morning and crows so loudly that she wakes up the whole farm? Perhaps she would even count the hens and the chicks to see if any are missing. And then, and then the farmer wouldn't need me anymore. And I'd have to go look for another job. I've got a She can herd sheep, said the dog. What if she rounds them all up and takes them to graze on the highest and, and the greenest hills? She might even chase a fox away or two. The farmer would be so pleased with her that it seemed me to live in the kennels. I would really hate that. Oh, how horrible, said everyone. Animals are really worried, aren't they? Wow! What if she can catch some mice? Said Cat. What if she catches all the mice in the barn? And a few rats too. Maybe even the spiders would be scared to live there. And then the farmer would get rid of me. And I would become a stray cat. Oh, I'd really miss my milk and my and my sardines. Oh, how awful, said everyone. Mm, what if she can give milk, said the cow. What if she fills up all the pails on the farm with such a rich creamy milk that everybody wants to buy it? then nobody would want mine. And the farmer would make me pull the plough instead. Mm, I'd miss my cosy stall. Oh, how appalling, said everyone. <laughs> what if she can grow wool, said the sheep. What if she has a thick woolly fleece that is whiter than snow and softer than silk? And maybe her coat will grow twice as fast as mine. The farmer would be so delighted that he'd only use, use my wool to stuff pillows, all pillows and cushions and stuff. Bah, I couldn't stand that. Oh, how terrible! said everyone. Ay, ay, ay. <clears throat> what if she can pull a cart, said Horse. What if she can take a cart full of fruit and vegetables to the market faster than I can? She might even give rides to the farmer's two children. Then there would be no place for me and I would end up in an old horse's home. 
I'd miss us all. I'd really miss all my friends here. Oh, no. How frightful, said everyone. Now the animals were so busy worrying that they didn't even notice that some of the young farm animals were missing. Mm -hmm. uh, where are my puppies? said Doc. Wow! Where are my kittens? said the cat. Ah, where is my lamb? Bad the sheep. <gasps> no, I wonder where they are. No, I'm worried. All the animals searched and searched, but they could not find them anywhere. They looked from the barn all the way to the pigsty with no luck. Oh, 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 this is dreadful, crowed the rooster. How horrible, with the dog. Wow, awful, mouthed the cat. Mm, appalling, mooed the cow. Bah, terrible, barked the sheep. Mm, frightful, neighed the horse. But suddenly, across the field, they saw something. Do you know what they saw? Do you? A very strange animal indeed. It was leaping and bounding towards them. Hello, it said. I'm Kangaroo. Oh, it's a kangaroo. The animals couldn't believe their eyes. Kangaroo had a big pouch in her tummy. And inside the pouch, you're never going to believe this, were three kittens, <laughs> two puppies, and one lamb. A teeny tiny lamb. We've had so much fun going on a tour of the farm, said Kangaroo. What if I, what if I were to be the babysitter for them every day? Oh, what a good idea, the farm animals cried. And with a crowing, a barking, mowing, mooing, buying, and neighing, they all welcomed Kangaroo to her new home. Oh, that's so pretty. Should they have been worried? No. Everything worked out for the best. Did you like your story, little sheep? Me too.